previously on the Boston Major. Surviving through it, Black Lady with the damage. The Terrorblade gets to work. It's a triple for him. It's likely to be a quad. Misery with the TP out. He won't make it. Faceless slamming the door. There's the stop to start with the disruption. Counter initiate. Now the Alki Slash. Dragging Resolution back as they retreat out. XY already used the spell steal. He does have his own disruption available. Oh, All the eclipse from Black committed earlier. They get the Dragonite kill. Now they look for the turn. Trying to bring down Resolution. Very low. Will end up falling to the end. Moon Meander a bit late to the party. So it ends up being a two for three exchange. And they do have a stolen disruption. It's going to be a two for four. Nuts. Just left alone in that fight. DC. Ended a final dagger into the heart of faceless fans everywhere. It will be an early exit from them, and they'll have to go back to the drawing board for the next event. The fight, MSS, Raw, Zing, Global Sans, the only sign's not enough. They focus down. The Bayman is not in. There goes your GA. They don't have the damage output. Even with the purification of brains, that bane them for half-life again. MP for all their initiation have done no damage and now we'll start losing heroes. Garda protected by that repel. It's gonna last a little bit longer getting back in range of the Great Wave. The Sun keeping out the Golem on Chicken with another leap up, but SVG is there for the fire strike. Arrow flies up and it'll be Lana stunned and held. They go for a second final bond, and now it's MP rolling through them. They'll beat Lana down, and it's a double kill. During the Boris strike fall, but they all get fatally bonded. They have to bail out. Henry! In for the jump! Triple kill! He's done the work! Even the arrow to Old Chicken! It was all set up by the fatal bonds! And he hurt! Together they are tethered with a glimpse back into him! They go again! SK will find the kill! He'll start up, the Eclipse goes to work, but Luna's already down. Has to dive back for her. They'll get another one. This is the game. They've lost the DK. And P will do it. They bring down E Home. Two to one. And advance themselves forward in the Boston Major. It was a tough round one opponent for them, but they bounced back so well from that game one defeat. there by Thug. Unfortunately, Alerta doesn't have the same kind of mobility. They're going to need to get off the BKB, but it doesn't go down. First strike comes out first, and they've already blown up the big carry of that Venom and taken down the Bane as well. BKB TV out for one, but the supports and the utility off lane won't be as lucky. The Fountain once again. They need a big combo. Sand King, Epicenter into Fatal Bonds, Warlock. That's pretty much all they can do. There is still no BKB on the Alchemist. Uh, nor Jump forward, there's their initiation. Immediately stop. Skylar in place with the Spike Hair base. They try and drop the Chaotic Offering, catching multiple heroes here. But Thug is right in the middle of so these heroes and they're dropping low. Thug, he's hit by the Eclipse, brought down as SC gets the, the jump onto him. And Finnum going crazy inside the booth. Cheering, yelling in one unified voice. See 
the first casualty on LTD. The epicenter coming through, bringing Ame down low. He keeps himself alive with the invest. Finally dropped. He's out for 100 seconds, maybe as well. He does have buyback in the SF. Victoria buying back as well. They've got to hold this defense. The base, but he plays through. He hits the agent, and it's all over. LFY, LGD forever young. Take game one. He loses his life as well, and GG is called. It's all too much here for LGD's original squad. And it'll be LFY moving on as the last representative Chinese side here at the Boston Major Band. Yeah, and it is no surprise that, like, Xiaowei's team always performing.